Welcome to my YouTube channel, Flexbone FB, where I want to share what I know about the greatest offense there ever was. Uh, let me give you a quick introduction about myself. I grew up in the state of Alabama, and like most people in the state, you make a choice. And thank God that my parents had chosen Auburn for our family. And uh, I walked on in 1992 under Pat Dye. Um, was a quarterback for a year, decided if I ever was going to see the field, I need to get on special teams. So when Terry Bowden came in in 1993, um, I swapped over to the defensive side of the ball, played strong safety, and got on all the special teams. I wound up breaking my neck in the spring of 95, and that's how I got into coaching. I stayed on just three more years as a student assistant coach and just really felt – um, as football and, and, and to continue coaching, it was a calling, just like pastors are called to a church to preach the gospel. I just felt like football was a calling for me as a way that, that I could make an impact and, and um, uh, you know, use it as a tool to make young men better young men and, and also a way just to, to spread the love of Christ. Um, so I'm going to give a quick rundown of where I've been in the state. So I started at Ufala High School on the defensive side of the ball, doing outside linebacker, then defensive line. Took a job at Fort Walton Beach High School, followed the coach from Ufala when he got the job down there as co-defensive coordinator and defensive line. Uh, went to Auburn High School for nine years. Um, did everything from wide receivers to inside linebackers to outside linebackers and eventually became the quarterback coach and offensive coordinator in a um, kind of a hybrid system. It was a little bit old school, eye formation, a little bit of spread, a little bit of air raid. So we just took different offenses, stuck them together. Uh, became a head coach at Montevallo High School right outside of Birmingham, ran the wing tee. That's where really fell in love with the idea of that that having a system rather than a hodgepodge of plays. Uh, wanted to get back into the larger school classifications in Alabama. At the time, we had 6A was a large classification, which now we have 7A, and Oak Mountain was a very large high school. So I wanted to get back into big-time football. So I took a job at Oak Mountain High School. A new coach came in and was running option football. So me coming from the wing tee in that system to where we ran a little midline, to what he wanted to do was a perfect fit. And I learned a ton more about option football. And this is where I started just to immerse myself into to Army and Navy and Georgia Tech and, and, and you know, Georgia Southern, places that had traditionally had run the, the triple option um, or had recently come into it. And so this is where I threw myself into the offense. We ran the flex bone. Um, I think to this day he's running the split back veer there, but it was all option based. And this is where I kind of fell in love with the flex bone offense. Took a job at Homewood High School. They ran the spread. Um, was there for one year as a quarterback coach and offense coordinator. And then I wanted to be a head coach again. So I went to Gulf Shores High School, ran the wing tee, and then ran the shotgun wing tee and, and was going to go to the flex bone in the next year. But I wound up taking a job at Opelika High School as a wide receiver coach. Uh, Opelika is just one of these good old football towns to where football is very important to them and they do it well. A buddy of mine got the head coaching job at Smith Station right outside of Columbus, Georgia, in Phoenix City, Alabama, another large school. And um, I was offense coordinator there for two years. And so I bounced around the state, met a lot of great people, and, and I have really been blessed. Every head coach I've ever worked for has been a very godly man and influenced my life. Now, what's the purpose for this channel? Well, the first thing is just fellowship. Who doesn't like to talk football? So recently I um, took a job as an assistant principal at a junior high school. Um, uh, and just needed a change in life. And I thought, uh, hey, I can't get totally away from the game of football. So um, I still watch practices. I still get on huddle and do that. But uh, it's just good to, to share, you know, what I know to gain insights, what other people know. And I didn't want to completely leave the game of football. So um, through my Twitter account and, and my YouTube channel, it's just to, to talk ball. Um, also, say I want to learn. You know, I want to learn more about the flexible offense. So if you see something on this channel or a drill that, that I'm teaching wrong or could teach it a better way or a different way, please let me know. Um, I want to learn. And the last thing is just share what I know. Um, I spent a lot of hours listening to podcasts and reading books and downloading playbooks and comparing them and um, watching every flexbone on their team 
that, that runs it on Saturdays. I just immerse myself in this offense. So, you know, A, it, it can be like a clinic for veteran coaches, maybe find out different ways to, to run it um, and, and get ideas from that. For new coaches, it can work as an installation guide. I want to do it in order to just like if I was putting together a video playbook for the players or for uh, coaches on my staff that aren't familiar with Flexbone. Um, and, and then every now and then I'll just throw in some random topic. Uh, and the last thing just for football fans, for anybody that just wants to know more about the, the game of football and, and the different offenses that are and specifically the Flexbone and, and you know, the, the ins and outs of it. So I hope you'll get something from this channel. Um, I, I've enjoyed even starting it up and, and delving back into the, the flex bone world after, after um, you know, going over the dark side of, of running spread and air raid uh, offenses. So if you would subscribe to my channel, you know, send me messages. I'll, I'll try to do at least a video a week. I had planned on all these five minutes or less, but I just upgraded my screencastify on the Google suite will let me do unlimited now. So, um, uh, but these videos were very, very seldom go over 10 minutes. Um, because it's hard for me to, to watch something more than that, and I don't want to bore you with it. So subscribe to my channel also. Flex, um, Flexbone FB is my Twitter uh, account, if you will. Check that out as well. All right. Stay blessed.